up it's war chief and today i'm going to show you how to save your cpu it's a really cool technique that i use a lot and i am going to show you right now I got ableton opened up we're going to try to play this but my cpu is just going to crash and it's going to glitch and some like total trash all right let's do it <laughs> You see how it's just totally not going to work. I have so many instances my computer can't even keep up with the audio. So what we're going to do is a quick like fix. It's really easy to do. And if you know about this, great. If you don't, get ready to learn something because I always use this technique. In reality, you're not going to have 15 instances of Serum. So we're going to cut all these out. So these three are all different sounds. You're going to press Alt or Option T. You will get a audio track. In, in this audio track, you're going to want to go where it says Exit and go to Resampling. And then what you want to resample, you're going to want to solo and then record on the audio track. So let's record this or resample. Then we're going to do it to the rest of them. You can tell the CPU is very, very low. It's because audio is processed better than MIDI. I will give you another example. All right, this song is called The Forest. You can check it out on SoundCloud or YouTube. I'll leave a link down below or I'll put a card up here. I always do my drums in audio because it's so much lighter on my laptop. I use a MacBook Pro. It's uh, 2015 macbook pro it's fairly new ish kind of old but anyways it cannot take that much midi at all so i always use audio for my drums and then if i do midi like in my sense over here you'll see my serum and then i always bounce down my midi but i turn off my midi and i keep it up above my audio just in case i want to change something and i'll bounce it back down to audio again. I always bounce stuff down to audio so my computer can run its smoothest always because you never want to open your project and you don't know what's wrong or why it's glitching out. You just don't ever want that problem. So this is the number one reason I always bounce stuff down. As you can see, I did it with the plugs. I did it with the pads. These are just drums. I use some grave stuff. This is the number one way that I think, I believe in, that will help you with your CPU issues. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked the video, leave a like, comment below, tell me what you thought about this, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.